Socialist candidate Francois Hollande and French President Nicolas Sarkozy are gearing up for the final round of voting in France's presidential election. But a surprisingly strong showing for far-right candidate Marine Le Pen has changed the dynamic of the race. Le Pen took more than 19 percent of the vote, the best ever showing for the anti-immigration National Front Party. Although she won't move on to the final round, her politics are likely to color the election as the two remaining candidates reach out to the fringes of their parties. All together, the left represents today 44, 45 percent of the French electorate, much, much more than in 2007. It is very unlikely that the majority of the electorate of the extreme right will come to Nicolas Sarkozy. He's lost two million votes between 2007 and 2012. Can he get them back and where? The answer is far from clear. Sarkozy has become the first sitting president in the history of the Fifth Republic to lose the first round of elections. Ahead of the vote, Hollande appears to have the advantage. We are very proud to be ahead uh, in this first round and we feel that uh, if we go on, if we keep on, then uh, victory uh, can be ours, will be ours. And uh, it's an historical event to have a, 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 a president who is defeated in the first round. It never happened before. A huge score from Mr. Hollande. We feel a great hope and need to change. Hollande and Sarkozy have until the final round of voting on May 6th to make their case. Merci d'aimer à ce point la France.